on our way to Crossroads Church to lay out the conference program to get ready to mail to you guys. We're really excited this year for Northwest Ministry Conference 19. We've added a brand new arm, it's called Mental Health. I've been a kids pastor for 33 years, and when I look back on my years, I keep thinking to myself, I, I had no idea where to send or refer kids or families to in ministry when trauma came up. I never really understood the difference between pastoral counseling or mental health counseling. In fact, I wasn't even sure what mental health counseling was, to be totally honest with you. And here we are in a day and age where it's almost like the peanut allergies of kids' ministries or ADHD. It just keeps popping up. It's not something that's going away. I think it's something that has been subliminal in our ministry, and we just as pastors weren't prepared or knew how to deal with it which is why we started this mental health arm. And Dr. Greg Jantz and I have been sitting, thinking about what would this look like? Um, how could we do this? And how can we equip pastors and encourage pastors and uh, counselors and lay people in our church that do great lay ministry or volunteers to be able to know how to negotiate this legally, professionally, and personally and still have our people be taken care of and still let us minister to them in that context. So that's again why mental health started. I've been going on way too long. You need to hear from Dr. Greg, but you need to bring someone to this aspect of the conference. If counseling is not your ministry and it really shouldn't be when it comes to us as pastors, then come and listen to the mental health arm for great information and bring some people along that will help move people to wholeness and hope inside of the mental health, well, the mental health uh, trauma of today's society in our churches.